All right, everybody. So, good morning, afternoon. Like, I'm trying to just for you. My name is Courtney, and this will be a coffee bowl by Michael Wadjoka. We'll be doing a plunge fusion and circuit today. So, you'll see some bar moves, some traditional bodies. We're going to be going for it three times through. So, get ready. I'll have some dance moves as we go. And if you're doing this for a repeated time, feel free to add weights or ankle weights. So we'll get started with the warm up. Go ahead and bring your feet a distance apart. Soften your knees. Take some big shoulder circles all the way up and back. Just opening up your chest. Reverse circle. Take it up and forward. Try not to arch to the back. Just take some big inhales and exhales. Good. And then take it out to the side with an inhale. Exhale. Come down nice and low. Inhale up. And exhale down. This should feel really good on your body. There's no crazy cardio. There's only one cardio move. You will say three times, but nothing too crazy. Like you might get classes, I promise. Four more. Four. We have three. We have two. Hold it up here in one. Take your right hand. Grab that left wrist. Stretch up and over to the right. Bring your right shoulder forward towards your screen. Good. And then inhale up through center. Switch that grip. Left hand takes you up and over to the left side. Good. And then bring it back through center. This time we're going to add a row of bang at the top and then swing down a little bit deeper. Reaching with our triceps, pinky come up. So inhale, lift your heels. Exhale, swing. Take it up. Swing it down. Good. Up and down. That's it. Lift and up. Keep going up. We have three, we have two, and last one, stay down here. Don't come all the way down, just a diagonal, and just lift your feet knees up to the sky. So from the side, just like this, just give me a little keep those triceps. Nice job. Now shift your weight to your right leg, and extend that left leg. Yes, you're still pumping your arms. Just that left leg behind you. Just find your balance here for four, three, two, keep your arms going, switch your feet. We're just saying hello to so that balance. See where it is tonight. We're saying five, four, three, two. Release the arms back above your head and sit in the next one. Good. I want you to open your right arm to the right. Bring it up. Open to the left. And bring it up. Open to the right. And up. We're heating up the sides here. Stretching out the back. We're four. And up. Three. And up. Last two. And last one, check yourself forward. Your right hand goes down, open up to the chest. Good, draw some circles with that top wrist. Nice job. And then switch to your left hand underneath the heart. Open up your right arm and draw some circles with that top wrist. And then bring it down. Step your feet back into a plank position and make sure your shoulders are right above those two wrists. Good. Stick up your abs. Pull them in and up. Take your right knee. Bring it to your right elbow. Bring it across to your left. Back to the right. And put it up. Then switch left knee in. Across. Back to the left. Keep going. This is a bunch of wider. Right and left. In. Cross. And back. Bring it in. Cross it over. Good. Three more. In. Cross it over. Last two. You're still breathing. And last one, find your downward facing dog. Send the hips high. One of my favorite stretches here. Bend the knees right and left, right and left. Good. And then come back for your plank position. You're going to take a giant step outside of that right hand. Open up. Bring it back. And then get your one tricep push up, down and up. And then step with your left. Open left. Bring it down. You can always go to the knees for that tricep push up. And then back in three more just like that. So right foot, right arm, back to your plank, one push up, take it left, open. Again, feel free to come down to this knee. Wait, two more, right? Open, bring it back, one push up, and take it left, open. And then our last one each side, take it right, open. Feel free to come down to these knees. I can always feel a little bit lower that way. And last one. Good. Find your plank again. And give me a slow mountain climber right and left. Really firing up the abs here. Firing up the shoulders. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Downward dog one more time. Then the knees right, left, right, left. So walk your hands and knees to the middle of the mat. And roll on the top. Slowly. Facing the front here. We're going to take a curtsy with the prayer hands to the right and 
everybody. You have four more here. Last four. Last three. Last two. And last one. Bring the heels to touch and your toes open. This is called our Pilates D. You bring your hands to your hips. Simply lift the heels and while we're warming up the calves and ankles here. Good. If you're feeling good with your balance, you can take your arms above your head. Release them on your hips. Making sure all ten toes stay on the floor. For four. For three. For two, now leave them halfway up. Walk the toes to touch. I'm sorry, your heels to touch. Your toes are open. Those heels are touching. And then bend the knees. Close. Straighten those knees. Bend and stretch. Yes. Nice job. Rid your PDA. And stretch. Down and up. Four more here. Four. You have three. You have two. Stay down here on one. Just press those knees back. Little press and press. Press. Great job. Check in with your abs. Your hands are already there. Make sure they're fired up. Hold in for eight, seven, six, five. Good. Four, three, two, and one. Shake it out. Shake it out. Take your hands behind you. Interlock the fingers. Open up through the chest, stretching out, and then add a fold forward. Bring those arms nice and loose. And release. We have one more thing to finish our warm up here. I'm going to reach down towards your toes, walk yourself out into a plank. We're going to walk the plank here. It looks like this. We go right elbow, left elbow, right, left, and tap your right, and tap your left. All right, we take it right, left, right, left, tap right, tap left. You'll see this in our circuit in just a little bit, but I want to show you the pattern. Nice and slow. Right, left, right, left. Now switch. Lead with your left four times. Go left, right, left, right, and right. Do it again. Left, right, left, right, tap left. Two more to finish. Go down, down, up, up, tap. One more time. Down, down, up, up, tap. And then walk it down to those forearms. This is where we finish the warm up with a little shift run back. We come onto the tips of your toes. Press and keep your heels back. For eight, press. Seven. We have six, five, last four, three, two, and child's pose. Lower the knees, your big toes touch. Send your hips to your heels and just stretch it out. Take a deep breath in. And exhale, let it go. Good work, everybody. Go ahead and come to standing, and we will get started with our first circuit. So, I will count you through. Don't worry about keeping time or anything like that. Grab water in between circuits. Try not to grab it in between moves. All right, so we'll try to get through all 10 moves without stopping. Then get water. We're going through it three times. I'll cue everything, so just follow along, and we'll get going. So, we prepared for this a moment ago. Take a big step to your right with your right foot. Come down and give me four pulses. It's four, three, two, and one step to the left. And pulse curtsy. Four, three, two, and one. Big step and pulse. Good. This is the first move. This first round, we're not jumping. In rounds two and three, you have the option to add some air under your feet. I'll show you that when we get there. Just give me the heads up. Good. So one big step, four pulses. Four, three, two, and one big step. Get a look. Yes, I cannot see you. So I hope that you're getting nice and low in that curtsy. You can really press the palms together so that you're also activating through the chest. Big curtsy. Four, three, two, yes. And I like my notes of prayer because it reminds me to keep my chest up. Good. One more seconds, right where you are. Good, you guys. This is going to be a non-stop class. Really no break until we get in between those segments. Last three, two, and one. Shake it out. Come to the top of your mat. Cross your ankles and see if you can come down with control. Hopefully you didn't slam onto your feet. All right, we're going to do a quick crunch with a glute lift. Take your left foot and bend it. So your knee is up, your foot is down. Extend your right leg up to the sky. From here, you're going to lower the leg, lower your arms, come up, kick. Lower, come up, and kick. That's the first half of our move. The focus is on the abs. And then we'll get those glutes in just a moment. Good. I want you to think inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Have you guys about 10 
one second floor right here. Try to keep yourself right in the nose. Don't actually do that, please. And for three. For two. And then hold it up here on one. Keep reaching your arms, but lower your head. I want you to press for me to the floor. Lift those hips up. And lock. Lift. And lock. So now the focus is off this way. The left hamstring and left foot. Lift. And lift. Good work. Lift. Try to stick them as best you can through the right leg. If you're a little tight, maybe there's a slight bend, no problem. You have three, you have two, and you have one. Hug the knees into your chest. You lift your head, neck, and shoulders. Reach your arms above your head, reach your legs long. So both are about 45 degrees. And then wrap around, give yourself a hug. I want you to rock up to your seat and right back down with control. So it's a double leg stretch into rolling like a ball. Yep, so we reach, we wrap, we come up, we come back, all abs. Reach, wrap, come up, and back, nice job. Reach, wrap it up, come up. Yes, so you're really having to use strength here. So not use momentum. I know it's tempting to take a big rock, back and forth, but try just to rock up. Yes, you'll feel a huge difference. My abs are already firing up here. Reach, round, come up, and back. Good, reach, round, up. Two more, take it. Reach, round, up. One more time. Reach, round, come up, and then back to your back. This time, plant your right foot down, bend in that right knee, extend your left leg up. Reach your arms up. From here, you lower away and you come up and kick. Here we go. Crunch with the kick on the other side. Up. Then inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Good. I want you to be in charge of your breathing. I will cue it a lot in the style of class. But pretty much every breath is linked to the food. Just like in the video class. For three, for two, Keep your arms up here, rest your head. Now press firmly into this right foot, lift the hips, and lower. Good. So my arms are reaching long, energy shooting out through the fingertips, firing up that right hamstring and right up to Good. Lift. And lift. Use your abs here. Lift. And lift. Need five more. Five. You have four. Three. Two. And last one, tap your knees and walk yourself up and then come up to a standing. All right, it's a few standing moves, and this is one of them. It's a right lateral lunge. You're going to take your hands to prayer. Now shoot your arms up to the sky, bring it back to prayer. Come to center, other side, left. Shoot them up. Prayer. Back to center. Here we go. Right, left, right, center. Take it, left lateral, reach. Good. So your arms only go up when you push off the outside foot. Very good. The rest of your time. That's it. Really get low. Yes. If I told you to freeze, you can hold this right here. That's a little foreshadowing for our second and third round. We'll be holding it. So you kind of an extension of the warm up, if you will. We'll be a little bit more intense around the three. Nice job. One more each side. Right. Reach. And last one. Left. Reach. Great job. Catch your breath. Awesome. We're coming back down to the floor. You're going to be in all fours. So, take your hands right underneath the shoulders and your knees right underneath your hips. Extend your right leg back behind you. We're going to start with a simple lift the lower. Up and down. If you want more of a challenge, you're going to take your left hand to that right shoulder and balance just on one side. Yeah, you don't have to, but it's not. So I'm going to do several glutes exercises today. This is the one just for round one. This is a little bit lower. We're going to hold it up there in four, three, two, hold it up there.
jump. It's the left side, four pulses. Come up and over, four, three, two, up and over, just a little hop. That's all it is. If you're not into the hop, step. Give me four, three, two, one, step. Four, three, two, one, or take that hop. Good, I'll stop counting in case we're not on the same beat. I want you to not get confused. Just alternate, right and left, with those four pulses. How's the upper body? Are you still engaged? Press those palms together. Nice job, everybody. For 10 seconds mark. Come on, you got it. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and recover. Great job. Come on down. Cross your ankles. See if you can do it without your hands. Harder than it looks. But if you can, that's great control. Take your left foot down. Reach your right leg up. We lower and press. Here we go. Lower. Kick. Kick. Upper and lower abs. Working together here. Again, you're aiming right in the middle of your nose. Please don't actually kick yourself in the face. Great job. Really plan that left foot. So press it into the floor. It's not just hanging out. You are pushing down for that hands. For four. For three. For two, hold the leg up and arms up. Lower your head. Press into that left leg and low. Lift. If you need to bring it in a little bit, that's okay. Lift. And lift. Make sure your hips are even here. We're not going to do that one or the other. For eight more. Seven. God, I'm sweating. For four, two. We have five. We have four. Three. Two. And hug those knees into your chest. Lift your head, neck, and shoulders. From here, reach your arms and your legs long. Come up and give yourself a hug. Roll up to your seat. Right back down. So double leg stretch. Inhale, exhale, inhale, and exhale. Go ahead, reach, wrap, roll it up, and back. Good. You got to have control on the way up and on the way down, right here. Beautiful. Reach, wrap, come up. Right back down, good. Reach, wrap, up, and down. Reach, wrap, up. You have four more here. Four, and up. You have three. You have three big ab moves. Ab moves in a row. Last one. Reach, wrap, bring it up, and back. Plant your right foot. Extend your left leg. Reach your arms and leg in opposition. Come up and take. Here we go. Inhale, exhale. Yep. Not wasting any time in between these moves. I've got to get through the circuit three times. I want you moving this entire time. Good. Even if you have to take it down a level and go slower, just don't stop your forward momentum. We love that progress. Three, for four, for three, for two. Keep it up here on one. Lower the head. Keep your arms and legs lifted. Press firmly into this right foot. And let's do the hands through. Lift. And lift. Good. Up. And up. Beautiful job. Keep that left leg as straight as you can be. Eight more. Eight. We have seven. We have six. Five. We're coming up to stand. And four. And three. In two. And one. Up and we're going to step out with that right foot. We take it right. We lift. Right. Three together. Then left. Three. Left. Together. Good. A little add on this time. So if you like where you are, you want to stay here, by all means. Good. Take it right. Lift. And left. One more time, take it right, lift, and take it left. Now we're gonna hold this lift, hold it, hold it, hold it, and lift that left leg up. So watch your shoulders, pulse, 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 pulse. Good for a 10, nine, eight, seven, you've got six, five, last four, three, two, and one. Shake it out, cross your ankles, or just cross the legs and come down into all fours, however you wanna get there. All right, I send that right foot back behind you. Good. This time we're going to add the arm. We drop in, reach, and tap. So it's that same lift. We just add the drop in, reach, and tap. Here we go. Lift, bring it in, reach, and tap. Lift, bring it in, reach, and tap. Four more. Up, in, reach, and tap. Last three. Good. Two more. Up. In, last one, take it up, in, now hold that reach, our little lift, arm leg, lift, 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 
Let's go to your right knee, still facing the floor. Hands are in for eight, seven, six, five, last four, three, two, and one. Half the seat and just roll out those wrists. Awesome job, you guys. We're gonna walk the plank next. So go ahead and come into your plank position. From here, remember it's right, right, jump up, jump in, right, right, jump out, jump in, then switch. Left, left, jump out, jump in, left, left, jump out, jump in. If you're not jumping, it looks like this. Tap, tap, still a big challenge, even though it's just a pass. All right, go at your own pace. That's how you want first to the end. Make sure you're still breathing. Awesome work, everybody. Good. This is cardio if you're adding that little hop. And if you don't want it, no problem. Woo! Keep going. You should be definitely sweating at this point, especially if you're on a cardio team. Good. Last few seconds here. Five, four, three, two, and last one. Find your all fours. We'll get our other side. All right, extend your left leg out behind you, your right arm out in front of you. Good. Throw it in, reach, and tap. Here we go. Up, in, reach, tap. Lift, bring it in, reach. Pick it up without arching your back. Lift, in, reach. Good. Four more. Up, in, reach. Two small abs right here. Squeeze. Two more. Up. In. One more time. Take it up. Spin up. Hold on. Extension. And let's go. Hold it up. Uh, my arm is also pulsing with the leg. Lift. 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 So eight more. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Sit back. And just go out of those hips. Excellent work, you guys. We're going to come into our strong position. Stacking your hands one on top of the other. From your toes out, separate your legs and your knees to touch. From here, rest your head. In three, two, one. Then you're going to stop and lift those toes. Take up your body and lower. Good. Lift and lift. You've got it. Stay close to the sky, not behind you this way. Stay straight up. Lift and up. Good. Lift. You've got it. Turn off the back knee, I'll tell you more done. And flip straight down to the floor, lift. And I'm at four more. Go up, and up, and three, and up, last two, and lift, last one. And lift, take your hands underneath the shoulders, extend the legs, push yourself up into a plank. Here we go, we've got Pilates for feet. Jump it in, jump it up, down, and back. Maybe you step, come up. And step it back. It is your call. However, you get there. I just want you all the way parallel with the floor and then all the way perpendicular to the floor. Let's go, you guys. Your second to last time to see this move. We are almost there. Our third and final round is coming up. You have 60 seconds until you get that well deserved five break. Right? Let's go. Come on. Ten seconds. Push for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one. Awesome. Good job. Grab a quick sip of water and we will get going with our third and final round. Hey, Drea. All right, guys. I am sweating like crazy and this is Pilates with no equipment. So just imagine if I had you in the studio with equipment. We would be getting way crazy. All right, three. It just shows you what you can do with your own body. It's kind of amazing. All right, my friends. Take about 15 more seconds. Grab a towel if you need it, and we will continue with our third and final round. I'll stretch you out. You guys are out of here. All right, cool. About five seconds, and we'll get started with our four curtsy pulses. All right, in three. Two, on your third and final round. Give me four pulses on that right. And then stop or jump to the left. Four, three, two, one. I like the little hop if 
you're not into it, no big deal. Just take a big step and get rid of the four pulses. Good. Make sure you do have weight in both legs. It's not just a front leg exercise. Both legs here. Good. Make sure you're pressing those palms firmly. Awesome job. Get nice and low. Keeping that chest up. Nice and ready. Four, three, two, and switch. Four, three, two, and switch. Good. We have four more. Nice job. Three more. Excellent. Last two here. Last four, three, two, and one. Awesome job. Come to the top of your mat. Cross your ankles. See if you can come down without your hands. Maybe you did it. Maybe not. So you can move on. Plant your left foot next to your right leg up. We reach. We hit. Here we go. And lower. Big hit. Left the belly to pull bottom up. And we always try to get energy coming from the hamstring. The bottom of the leg here. Lift. And lift. Nice job. Up. And up. Good. Eight more. You got it. Seven. Big hit. Six. Exhale. Every time you come up for four, three, two. Hold it up here. Lower your head. Press up. Now this time it's a pulse. So don't come up and ask. Pulse. with a little tricep push-up, 
and right back up. So I cross and lift, cross and lift. Good. My toes are pointed to the sky, cross and lift. Good. You're not going to feel a lot of weight in your triceps here. Lift a little bit. But this is obviously for the inner thighs and butt. Look, I didn't say seat. <laughs> cross and lift, cross and lift. Four more. Four and up. Three. Here on one, maybe 16 pulses. Up to the side. Up. 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 Good. Lift. If you want a challenge, reach your left arm long. Lift for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Sit back, roll out your wrists. Walk them down and walk the plank. I'm just going to stay facing this way for this one. Come into your plank position. We walk it down, down, jump, up, up, jump. All right. In three, two, one. Let's go. Right, left, little drop. Right, left, drop, then switch. Left, right, drop, left, right. You're like, I have no idea what the right, left, up and down is. Just walk your plank. It doesn't really matter. As long as you're sometimes switching, that's cool. I try to do so many things at once. And that's okay. Let's go, you guys. About 10 more seconds. Left, right. And then right, left. For five, four, three, and last one. Come back into your all fours. I'm going to turn this way just so you guys can see. You can see facing the way you have it. Take that left leg up. This time, you're doing your tricep push up, coming behind, crossing that left leg over the right calf. Here we go. Cross and lift. Cross and lift. One of my favorites, because again, it's efficient. Getting more than one muscle group here. Cross and lift. Your thighs, butt, a little bit of upper body as well. Cross and lift. Cross and lift. Four more. Four. We have three. We have two. Hold up here on one. Little pulses. Take it up. 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 Up, straight to the side, lift, lift, take your right arm, reach it long if you shoot for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Come on down to your belly. Take those legs wide about mat distance, turning the toes out, bring them to touch, rest your head on top of your hands. Last round, upper body, take that back strength, and then glute strength. Here we go. Lift, and lift. You've got it. Up and up. Look close to the sky, not to the wall behind you. Lift. Up. And up. You've got it. Lift. And lift. Give me eight. Lift. Seven. Three. Six. Only one more dog for this. Five. Finish down with me. Four. And lift. Three. And lift. Two. And lift, last one. And lift, push yourself up into a plank position. All right, last minute of class right here. Come fly, jump up, down and back. Let's go. You're not jumping. Maybe you take it to a step, step. Maybe you add a heel raise right here. Lift, if you don't want to take the full jump. No matter what, I need you to give all that you've got because this is your last 30 seconds of class. Come on. Do not want to leave anything in your tank here unless you're running a marathon or something after this. But I kind of doubt that you are if you're doing this. Come on, you guys. Let's go. 15 seconds. Give me all that you've got for 10. You've got it. 8, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Careful when it comes to stand. Grab a quick sip of water. Meet me on your mat, and I will pull you down. Woo! Completely out of breath. I hope you guys are too. All right. Go ahead and meet me on your mat, and we will stretch it out just a little bit here. Take your right leg out to the right, kind of on the diagonal, and bring that left foot in. Reach up, turn towards your right foot, and then reach down. You can grab the flex pose if you can. So I'm going to point down and then pull. I just want you to make contact with that leg in some way. Think about pulling 
your chest, lift that right knee. Thank you guys so much. Keep stretching right where you are. I'm gonna put this up in case anyone was wondering about donations. I am taking donations for Project Bread. And I will put my Venmo right here. Keep stretching right where you are. I've not forgotten about you. All right, so if you guys wanna send any donations, greatly appreciated. All right, bring it up, switch sides. That right foot comes in, left leg goes out. Reach up first, turn towards your left leg, and forward fold. Pull the toes towards you, or pull yourself towards the back chin. Awesome work today, you guys. Thank you again so much. These classes are totally free at the moment. Hopefully they stay that way. It's just pay what you can. If you have anything extra to give, that keeps me in business. And it really helps a lot of charitable causes that I'm giving to every two weeks. Bring the soles of your feet together. Grab the ankles. Take a big breath. Inhale. Exhale. Round through the spine. Good. Inhale. Straighten up. And exhale. Round. One more time. Inhale up. This time forward fold. Use your elbows to press the knees. Excellent job, you guys. Again, my name is Courtney. Thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate you. And I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. All right. Thanks, guys. And I will leave this on my story. And it'll be on YouTube.